What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel or if you're new, howdy, my name's Fern. Today we're going to be checking out the Polaris One. And the reason this kit is called the One is because they have a new drum module which is just a singular power button and a giant knob for volume. And that's it. That's the entire drum module. But what's cool with, about this kit is that it comes with a lot of built-in features that are controlled by an app, which we'll go over more here in a sec. But let's just go ahead and see what this kit sounds and plays like. Alright, so there's a couple cool features with this drum kit that come in right out of the box. So from the factory, you're going to get a app called Instadrum, and that is going to be how we connect to this one knob drum module and access all of the sounds, the features, the settings, and everything to do with this drum kit. The reason that they decided to go with this route is because, you know, a lot of older drum modules and ones that I've had experience with, they tend to be kind of complex and unless you understand the terminology and also how to operate the interface it can be kind of a pain to just you know quickly dial in settings or change a drum sound or whatever it just takes a lot of learning and there's a big learning curve especially for beginners who just want to sit down and just play the drums real quick you know there is reactive leds built into all of the pads and symbols so anytime you hit something uh, the leds will duck out and correspond to what you're hitting and there's a reason for that so be sure to hang around for that from the factory this comes with 25 built-in drum kit sounds and five slots for you to be able to create your own drum set so um, tons of flexibility and i will go ahead and show you guys how to do all that in just a sec so unfortunately I didn't get to unbox this on camera, uh, but I will say that the nice thing about this drum kit is that the entire front rack comes pre-assembled. So you just have to stick on the pads and the brackets and just add on like two legs and the rest of the kit is already comes assembled. Big ups for that and uh, everything was packaged super well and arrived perfectly and safely. So as I mentioned there, are reactive lights built into all of the pads and you might think oh well, that's a silly aesthetic choice you know but there's actually a purpose for that it comes with 96 lessons and sheet musics for beginner to advanced drummers and the lights will correspond with the lesson material uh, so really handy little feature uh, the drum pads themselves feel really nice and uh, like i said they are built pretty well and are pretty reactive to what i play Pretty good. Everything build-wise is pretty solid and I'm really happy with how this is all holding up after, you know, just playing it for the last like 30 minutes or so. Can't really complain about anything. Uh, I do find myself occasionally forgetting to tighten down something. Uh, so if you are getting a drum kit like this, just be sure to go over everything at least once to make sure all the all your brackets and everything are tight, that way nothing is moving around on you while you're playing. Personally, I really like the design. I haven't seen a ton of other drum kits with LEDs built in. Um, and, you know, I'm a sucker for that kind of stuff. If I'm not mistaken, this is basically a complete drum kit minus the throne. This is my personal throne. Uh, but everything else that you see here, uh, the module, the three cymbal pads and the four drums and the kick drum and all the wiring that you need, 
uh, comes included, as well as a year membership to the app, which we'll go into more detail here in a sec. If you're new to electronic drums, there's also a very, very detailed manual that goes over everything and will be your best friend when you're trying to set all of this stuff up for the first time. So with electronic drum kits, typically the sounds are what kind of limits them. Um, So with this drum kit, you're getting a single mesh drum for the snare, which is nice. It's a little bit more reactive. Uh, and for toms, you're getting like this kind of hard rubber surface, as well as for cymbals. It's kind of like this hard, or like this soft uh, rubber that you're gonna be playing with the plastic backing. Uh, and they play pretty well. The only downside with this setup is that you don't get bells on the cymbals, uh, which is kind of not the greatest, but for an electronic drum set, not a deal breaker. A lot of other cheaper pads don't have individual regions for the bells themselves. Uh, so for me, not a huge deal. Uh, and the other function that is missing is that you don't have the ability to choke your cymbals, so. See, nothing happens. So that's also something to consider, uh, but the hi-hat does react to the pedal pretty nicely. And uh, all of the drum pads sound pretty good as well. Yeah, so everything seems to play pretty well and responds pretty well. So I did mention that there was 25 built-in drum kits into this module, as well as a bunch of lessons and like extra features, but you're probably wondering how the heck do I access them from a module that has one knob, no screen, no interface, no nothing. And uh, the way that they do that is through an app. And if you bought this drum kit, it'll include a QR code that will link you directly to uh, the app that accompanies this drum set, as well as a year of their membership. From here, you're just gonna set up a profile and we're going to go to connect e-drums and you'll see that i already had mine connected but you're just going to go to bluetooth and select the drums and it'll automatically pair with your module from here we just select in the right corner the drum kit and you'll see that on the app all of the hits that i do are going to correspond to the app but then you have Tons and tons of other drum kits. So we have the acoustic, funk, standard, jazz, dance, rock, uh, some classic 808 and 909s. Or if you want some power metal. And yeah, so there's 25 built in if you wanna just quickly select something and just start playing. If you want to go to the edit function, you can now build your own drum kit. So if you like the kick drum on rock and you like the snare drum on the other on the other stuff, then you can just go through, select the drum, you can select the volume as well, and you can just cycle through the different kick drums. And yeah, just go ahead and mix and match the drum kit to your liking and then you can just hit save. And there's five slots available for you to be able to do that. But yeah, so that's one cool feature about it. And also, if you need to adjust the sensitivity or the crosstalk, if you notice that other regions of the drum kit are being triggered by your hits, uh, you can just go into the setup, select that drum or play it. And then from here, you can adjust the sensitivity of the pad and the rim for the snare drum specifically. The other ones are just single regions. Uh, the crosstalk of the kit, which will mean that if I hit the tom, of it aren't going to pass through the rack and trigger the snare drum because it's such a low threshold so that's what the crosstalk is for and then lastly you have the velocity curve which just affects how linear the dynamics are of your playing so if you wanted to just be loud most of the time you can have this kind of curved up neutral response that will actually sound the way you're playing it so this was probably the fastest way i've ever been able to manipulate a module. Even on my Roland, I have some trouble doing this kind of stuff. 
Um, you can adjust the lights. You can either turn them on and off, and you can have them flash. So if you don't want that reactive light kind of going off, you can just... You can change that setting here in the actual app as well. And that's basically it. So from here, you now have access to the courses, your account, as well as songs. They have a library of songs that they have added into the app and have made correspond with this drum set. So you will be able to see the sheet music and what you're expected to play. You also have varying levels of difficulty. So if you want to just strip it back and you know just see where you're at and just gradually build up the way you would in a video game, that is an option as well. And if you are a premium member, then you can access all of the courses and play all the music in all levels as well as get all the accompanying sheet music for free. Uh, so like I mentioned, if you buy this drum kit, this comes with a uh, membership comes with this and uh, you can have up to four people on the profile. So if you and, you know, you say a sibling or a relative or someone else want to have their own progression, uh, you don't have to worry about overriding them or messing up their own musical journey. But yeah, so let's go ahead and go through some of the courses. So we have level one right here, which is just an intro. So the nice thing about this is that you have a teacher now. So you don't necessarily need to take lessons. You can go at your own pace. You can play on the pads themselves and on the app. But yeah, so this is a cool part of the app. As I mentioned, it will teach you the fundamentals, how to sit, how to hold stuff, what corresponds to what, green is kick drum, yellow is snare. And uh, you'll kind of just go from there. So we'll have the sheet music that plays and will kind of teach us what is what. At the very end of it, it's going to grade you on how you did both your timing, your musicality, uh, just to give you an idea of the ballpark that you're in with your playing. So the only functionality that this drum kit doesn't have is being able to import your own sounds. But no worries, that's totally fine. That's why we have a USB MIDI option, because you can connect this drum kit to other drum libraries such as Superior Drummer or Get Good Drums and have access to League's better drum samples so right now I've got it hooked up to Superior Drummer 3 and we'll be hearing that sound played through this kit. So after having the kit for a little while and playing on it, I definitely think uh, for the price tag and what they're offering to people is a pretty good value. You get a lesson structure, you get a remote controlled app, you get access to the premium membership. My only concern and an issue that I ran into was when I was trying to play this setup on double bass. So any of you metal drummers that are interested in this setup, um, you might have to consider a different kick drum pad or just triggering your pedals directly because I did find that once you pass a certain speed threshold, it does have trouble picking up those faster speeds like Once you get them off center, uh, as most double pedals are, because not every double pedal is perfectly centered, uh, that's when you start running into issues. Uh, some of the dynamics are more responsive when you're using the VST libraries, but that's just going to be personal preference. I've been playing on it for a while with my actual 5B, my Extreme 5B sticks. Um, the kit comes with a pair of much lighter sticks, um, but even with these heavier ones, it's been holding up pretty well. Nothing has shifted too much. Um, if it has, it's because I forgot to tighten it down. Uh, as far as like build quality, like there's nothing really to complain about. Uh, the only thing I wish this kit had was just a bell region for the cymbals, a choke, and then maybe a little bit more adjustability on this lower tom bracket. Um, you're kind of limited by the height of this leg that goes over here. Uh, but aside from that, the kit is nice. Out of the box, everything worked really well. Nothing was damaged. Everything was set up super quickly. Once I connected it to my drum library, it was even better. So positives. Kit looks great. I love the LED added. I'm a, you know, it's kind of like a dumb aesthetic thing to really be suckered into. But I do like how it is tied into the app uh, with the with the courses and lesson portions of the app. 
as well as helping you quickly identify what is what regarding the kit terminology, like the kick drum or the snare or the toms, like that's great. I definitely think this kit is geared towards a beginner to intermediate market. It's definitely gamified the lesson structure, which I think is a nice help, um, especially for people who grew up in the generation that I did when Guitar Hero and Rock Band ran rampant, and now I feel like those same principles are being applied in a more um, educational manner. Um, I like the grading system, uh, as well as the tiered difficulty settings of both the lessons and how you are playing along to the song library. Another huge benefit is how easily the connectivity worked with this thing. You know, it, it seems like a silly thing to say like, oh, I can just fire this thing up and just play. Uh, but that's not the case for a lot of other electronic drum kits. You have to do a little bit of the legwork. The Bluetooth connectivity with the phone uh, paired seamlessly and connecting it to my computer to work with my VST libraries was zero issue. Um, aside from having to have my computer recognize the drum kit and my recording program to interpret that this was a MIDI controller, uh, which is set up that I have to do for every device, it didn't take any additional prep besides that. Another huge plus was, like I mentioned, that the kit comes pre-assembled <laughs> uh, for a large part. So the whole front rack comes in as one piece out of the box and you just have to add on two legs and the pads and brackets. So it really tremendously decreased the setup time. Something that should be addressed is because the system is so s simple and dependent on the app, you're kind of at the whim of the company continuing to update the app to work with this drum set and modern smartphones as everything goes forward. If you do decide to download this app, there's some, it's very limited in terms of what is accessible for free. Obviously they want to be paid for all of the curation and plans and lesson structures that they have created. So it seems fair for them to charge. It seems like the lesson and song structure aspect of this particular application is very dependent on you having a membership. Another con that I have with the kit is just not having the bells be a region on the pads, um, as well as not being able to choke the cymbals, uh, which seems like a silly thing, but as someone who comes from a live drum background, it's definitely, it's, it's nice to be able to physically hold something and know that you're gonna silence it, but on this drum kit, you kind of just have to let them play out. So final verdict, what do we think about this drum kit? Personally, I kind of like it. I, I'm a sucker for the visual aspect of it, you know, as dumb as that is. But I also really like the app component. It does have its drawbacks and it does have its flaws. Uh, but I do like the direction that this technology is heading. Um, it's making it more accessible and easier for people to understand and learn drums. So being able to have an electronic drum kit that comes with a lesson plan, instructors and like all that cool stuff built in, that you can handle at your own pace and learn as you go, I think is a huge, huge win for the drumming community as a whole. For better or for worse, like that there's not a complex module to deal with. Um, there's less stuff to hit, there's less things to go wrong. Uh, but yeah, so would I recommend this drum set? Uh, I think I would. I would recommend it to people who have never played drums and want to learn, all the way up to intermediate drummers. But yeah, so what did you guys think of this drum kit? How do you think it sounds? How do you think it looks? Uh, let me know in the comments below. Uh, I would love to hear what you guys think. Be sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. If you guys wanna see more reviews on things like this, be sure to let me know in the comments below. But all right, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Mwah. Goodbye, guys.